Hey everybody, I received my three queens today from Texas and they are Varroa resistant and they're supposed to be, this is pretty cool how I received them in the mail in this envelope here, priority mail from Texas to Florida. And you can see there's other worker bees in these little cages with them. And they're in there helping out the queen. And what you do is you take this end out here, a little cork, and put it in the hive. And the other bees on the, in the beehive chew through this piece of candy here. And these bees chew this way and the other bees that are existing in the hive already chew from this way and they slowly chew through that piece of candy right there and release the queens you can see my bees are coming from my hives and they're catching this pheromone and uh, they're already accepting these queens I don't know which hive they came from but I got ten of them out here so we'll see what happens here in the future hopefully all of my bees, uh, as I work through this in the next four months or so, I can take queens that they create from these queens and requeen the other hives with these uh, Varroa resistant queens. And therefore, I won't never have to use any more chemical. And it'll be a great thing. We'll have a bunch of chemical free. Bees with chemical free honey, which I haven't never used chemical anyway, but I've lost several colonies because of it. But I didn't want to use any chemicals. Well, I'll give you all an update here in the future to see what's going on. But the new honey I have now is outrageous. It's, uh, oh my gosh, it tastes like cotton candy. So y'all have a nice day. The next bee update in about 30 days.